How are you doing YouTube and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. This is episode 33 and it's the third episode into season 2 now because we are now using a new map. Um, I come bearing some very small bad news um, but it's not that bad because um, I'm going to back it up with some good news. So the bad news is um, unfortunately um, because we only literally just started in the past two episodes was kind of showing you around spawn. Um, in the past two episodes, I've kind of shown you um, kind of uh, west and east of the divide, and um, I didn't really get up to much anyway. And I've reset the map because this is where the good news kicks in. This is now on a server, okay? So the other close Minecraft players that I play with will will get the IP. It's whitelisted, so unfortunately, I can't just like let everyone come on unfortunately because there's no plugins as such and stuff like that so it's only like my real close minecraft friends for now um yeah and the only th there is another bit of a hiccup that i've i've you know a few little problems that i've been coming across since the server's been online um it's been crashing a couple of times and i'm not really 100 percent sure why um um, I was having, just uh, before I started recording this, I was having frames per second issues. I've locked it at 40, so that's all good. So as you can see, there's no bed down here and everything like that. It is literally how you find the map, and there's a creeper down there. So, um, in between this episode and last, not only have I got the server now online, um, worst case scenario, if I still have problems in, in regards to the server crashing, um, what I will be doing is... Um, concentrating on maybe um, increasing the server's RAM because it's only literally um, the equivalent of Realms but Realms has never had this problem um, of cr uh, you know it just says server closed if that becomes a problem um, I'll, I'll literally cut the camera and um, I'll literally try and fix it out and then hopefully come back uh, as soon as I can with some answers worst case scenario I'll go put it back into a, a single player world and go from there so we're running the latest snapshot as you can see and um, yeah, so let's uh, get out of this because I know roughly where I'm going. Um, there is a world border on this on the server on the map, and the world border is from literally the peak there, and it goes 3,000 blocks in all directions. So hopefully that's more than enough for the people that may want to play. Um, and going back to what I was saying about in between this episode and last. The last couple of episodes has just been kind of showing you around spawn um, to the, each side of the divide and telling you why exactly I've kind of chose one with so much plains and mountains around. It's just basically for people that lag. You've got lots of plains to build on and stuff like that. Um, but in between this episode and last, I've been concentrating on um, trying to get myself a little base. Now, I almost gave up, but... I kind of thought, right, I'm going to go into a single player world, load up the seed, which I will give you now. Uh, as you can see, I've been doing some um, kind of admin stuff. So we're going to type in seed, and there you go. That is the seed uh, for this map, so if you want to play along. Now, I was kind of cheaty, but to the point where um, it will work in my favor when I'm building and stuff. Um, and the reason I say cheaty is because... Um, when I loaded this map, I went into uh, I went into single player, loaded this map, uh, went in spectator mode, and was just having a general look around. Um, I did originally find something that caught my eye in in regards to terrain. Now I've got the coordinates of the place because I've tried finding it before without it as like a little mission for an episode, and I couldn't find it. So I know roughly where I'm going. It's kind of this direction. It's about a thousand blocks out. And um, yeah, so it's not exactly close to spawn, but um, that would be the challenge is trying to link my base up with spawn maybe. It, 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 this will be at least my science lab. I'm going to go straight into the lab, stroke, maybe even live around near the lab. I'm not 100% sure. Now, so I was in spectator mode. I was, I was floating in the sky, just kind of having a look at the terrain. And what happened was, is I, something caught my eye in the mountains. Okay, so it's like where I'm going is literally really tucked away and it's so tucked away that it's quite hard to get to as well so let's let's have a look at F3 so we need to be on uh, Y minus 32 so we need to kind of go this way but at the same token 
I'm gonna um, grab some wood while I'm here and it's really tucked away it's really out of the way it's it's very it's quite well I would I wouldn't say it's really really hard to find but for someone that's just walking around the chances of someone coming well you, unless I go go there on camera it's quite difficult to try and um, pinpoint exactly where we're going so hopefully the server will behave and hopefully we will not crash um, so I've kind of been making tweaks hopefully that will um, stabilize the server itself uh, worst case scenario I'll have to increase the RAM again um, but like I say it's pretty much running the equivalent of a realm server so because I was doing a bit of homework and realms is only one gig of RAM can you believe that and we had very little problems last time um, this time around we're not using realms we're using kind of a, a private IP which will enable us, enable us to use as, as you've seen when I press um, F3 we um, using the snapshots now so when we know that they're safe whenever a snapshot comes out what we will do is we will check to see if they're safe and I need to keep an eye on this so we need to go to minus on see where it's um, going down 72 70 69 that sort of stuff we are going to get to minus 30 that is that's key right now and we're pretty much halfway already um, it's just getting there that is that is the annoying part I could just fly there, but um, I want the challenge of kind of actually better get some grass and stuff. And hopefully, hopefully we won't have a crash because the server's been really, really naughty recently with crashes and stuff like that. I've never had problems with vanilla, so you know, like that before. It's quite abnormal. So we're nearly at minus 32, because at the moment we're now minus 1, 2, 1, 2, okay, and we keep going in this direction. This is the general direction we need to go. I'm hearing lava. Okay, we've got forest fire going on here. And what I'm going to try and do is keep high up, because I know that these mountains are quite tricky to kind of get across. Um... It's a little bit of a cave system, and I just fell. Okay, and we're going to keep going this way. We're at minus what well, we are now. Oh no, we're on one again now. So I think we're getting there. Let me just try and get up. Okay, we're getting close, I think. I know, I remember a floating island. I'm going to plonk this bit of dirt down because I don't need it. A floaty island. I know there's lots of them, but uh, there's one distinct one, and it's getting dark already, which ain't good. It's never good. And we're gonna go kind of this way, and we are still on zero, so we're still 30 blocks. 30, what was it 33? 33 blocks. But we need to climb. We need to climb. Whatever we do, we need to climb. I think it's night. Well, it's getting night time, so uh, we're gonna need to start thinking in terms of just kind of holding out here a little bit and seeing how we get on there might be some world gen lag as well because obviously it's a fresh map literally from the moment I pretty much started with this episode is pretty much a brand spanking new map so there you go as you can see I'm getting some of the basics and we could probably make some torches out of some wood here while we're waiting I guess so there's no bed there's no um, bed by where the spawn is literally this is now on a server as you can see it's just come up which is good it's all good so I'm gonna get these episodes out prior to the first of January where the other guys can start coming on and build and then eventually we can interact and stuff like that especially when I've got everything stabilized that's that's to me a good bargain so I think what we're going to need to do is just kind of get some more wood. And hopefully we're going to be golden. I'm hearing noises. Oh, is that the is that the furnace? I believe that's the furnace. Let's just turn all them to planks so we can use it as fuel. 
So one, two, three, four, five, six. I think it's a plank for a, a, a log, I think. So yeah, we need to get kind of, um, let's have a look at the, the coordinates again. So we're on, sev um, the x is 769.4. We've got to get to 1354. So we're about 600 blocks away. So we're not far from where I want to build. Now, like I said, it's not near spawn. I kind of liked, normally, whenever I build, I kind of really need to stay near spawn because I, I feel it's the best way because you're near everyone. But the trouble is there's no... This place where I found, I've kind of ideated... Whenever I play Minecraft on a new map, I have to look for an area which starts sparking me ideas. And the place that I found um, did exactly that. It looked cool in a way, and I started thinking, right, I could build paths there, I could build steps there, I could build this, that, and the other there, and it's it's really cool. I like it. Um, and also, uh, remember me saying that I was in spectator mode on a single player map, just having a look around, because I thought, I'm going to cut some time down here, and I'm going to just try and look for... Um, I'm going to try and look for... A place to live and I eventually found it and this place to live also when I looked underground it, this is not what got me as well what got me was what it looked like above ground or on the surface can I get up here okay there's a lot of water around there okay there's a lava lake going here and my mouse pad thing isn't working I wonder if I can get that way it's kind of awkward because I've not, act I've kind of flew to where it was and found it. Whereas this time round, I'm trying to get there via foot. So we're gonna have to try and really go. The thing is, we've amplified it as well. It's it's very difficult to get around. <laughs> so we haven't got no wings yet. Because obviously, Minecraft now has wings and stuff that you can have. I think this might be a decent way to go. Oh no. This could end badly. Oh, it did. It ended very badly. Dang it. Okay, so the moon is actually going down, so I might risk it for a chocolate biscuit. So what we need to do now is go all the way back, but I'm going to go a different route this time. I didn't really get much tools, like decent tools, but um, good job it's not a hardcore let's play, huh? That would have been over and done with very, very fast. And... Um, so yeah, um, this place is is quite far away. I'm gonna get free up, make sure that we're uh, on track. We're gonna have to literally peg it. I'm gonna probably grab some food on the way. There's lots and lots of cows and pigs and all sorts of jargon. Um, so yeah, uh, where was I? I was I was trying to talk about um, why I chose it. So I was in spectator mode, and um, I was floating above ground, saw somewhere I liked, and then when I went what sealed the deal for me when I went underground in spectator mode is I saw four, right, four dungeons, like spawners, okay? Um, I think there was two zombies, one skeleton, and a spider one. Now, I, now this is where I'm going to leave it for the challenge. I'm, I didn't write down any coordinates in that world just as a heads up. The only coordinates I've now wrote down is exactly where my place is um, because otherwise it's going to be tedious to try and get there. As you can see I've already died and um, I'm trying to trying to get there. So we want to try and avoid going the same way. We're 130 odd blocks away uh, to on the wrong side. Let's grab some Let's just grab some uh, tools, I guess. Okay, and then we go like this, and like that, and like that. That will do for now. It's really weird playing um, 1.9. I've got to admit, the combat is so different. I mean, watch. <laughs> You got to time your your swings a little bit. It's not mashing them up. You got to be very careful. That worked. It's got an achieve. 
Okay. I've got zombie flesh. Maybe I should kill him. No zombie flesh. It's tight. Okay, we got to try and get our way. We're 120, but we got to make our way forward best we can. And I think going over this little bit here will do it. Okay, I've got a zombie after me. Maybe two. There's a nice little cave system here. Okay. Go this way and we use the zombie flesh. Oh, this looks cool. I don't even think this is it. This is not it. It's got a similar kind of entrance, I guess. This is not a bad little place. Like an archway. There's so many good little places on this map, though. If you want me to be completely honest, there's there is there is I think there's something for everyone on this one. So. You got time. It's all about timing. Right, I need to get some food sorted. Sorry, cow. Come here. Okay, that will do. And then we'll go grab some goodies. Okay, we're 131, so we are about 160 blocks to one out, you know, in the opposite direction in regards to the Z thing. Is that enough? Yeah, that's enough. Okay, and then we're going to go like such. And what we're probably going to do is upgrade my sword because that one just doesn't work for me. And we're going to put that sword there and cook our food. It's got kind of like this sort of feel to it um, as a heads up. It's got kind of like this little entrance, but it's a smaller entrance than that. Um, it's really quite discreet. And there's no, is there any coal around? There is, but it's not within reach. I'm going to chance this rotten flesh. Oh, no. Oh, that should regenerate. I think you only regenerate, the regeneration now is a bit different as well, if I believe I'm correct. Okay, let's get this. Okay. And then we're going to go head in this way. Yeah. This is a lot better this way around, I guess. I hope. I don't know, actually. So I think that's roughly where we went. That way and up that way. So we're going to go this way and try and get higher ground. Oh, he says. I don't think we're going to get across there, do you? No. There's no way in the world we're getting across there. So we're going to have to go this way. But we're about, so, yeah, so we're almost where we were before. But that's fine, not a problem. If we see any sheep, we're taking them. Taking them to cleaners. I think maybe it might be worth not going that way and going this way. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. But I've got a feeling that we go slightly off track and eat some food. I'm surprised um, that 1.9 didn't get released before Christmas. Or even 2016. 2015. We've had snapshots, granted, but we haven't had like an official update since September 2014, I do believe. Okay, this is going to be dangerous. Oh, crikey. Yeah, it's very dangerous. Let's get out of here. I'm not used to the combat system yet, so that's that's going to be intriguing when I go when we have the big big fights. I'm wondering if I might have to nerd pole. See if we can go this way. I think we went this way last time. Yeah, that's where the cave is, I think, over there. Okay. Um, this is really tough. It's because 
Amplified, man. Amplified to do that to you. Is he going to fall on me? I'm just going to mash it. I don't care. Let's grab a bit of dirt on the way up. This is a long journey. A long, long journey. But, hopefully it's going to be totally worth it. There's a lot of potential where I'm going. Put it this way. A lot of potential. And mainly potential for, say, my secret lab. Well, it's not going to be secret, because people that watch this can see it. But, uh, you know what I mean. I don't mind people having a look. I'm going to try and nerd pole up as high as I can. Okay, and then we just stick it there. That's fine. Wow, we're getting high up now. We have no food though. We're very high. There's no food. We could. We're getting lots of frame rate lag now. Hopefully, this will work out. Ah, it's a ledge. This is pretty much new terrain, if I if I'm correct though, as well. Ooh, 15 frames, ouch. Okay, we'll let everything load a little bit, let the frame rate come back. Okay, it's going back up again. There's a lot of uh, generation going. And we're at Y11, which means we're nowhere near the Z totals. At uh, Z totals. Okay, oh, look at all this. 10 frames. 20 frames, 15 frames, and it's oh, and it's saving. So if we go this way, I do believe this way is the better way. I'm trying to remember, let's fall down here. Minus 26, so we're almost kind of in line. Three, 33. Now it's just a case of going that way. So we need to get around this cliff. There must be a way around. Oh, there's creepers everywhere. And skeletons. This is where I'm going to get done over. Oh. Ah, see you later. Later, taters. Okay, I think I'm close ish. I think I'm very close ish. We're going to take some of this as well so we don't have to come back. I'm only going to take a little bit. I always like it to regrow, just in case. Never drain it dry. Oh, it's a bit of a mission, but trust me, just because of the dungeons, that, that those dungeons underground seals the deal for me. Seals the deal. I think this is it. I think this is like... Like I say, it's really out of the way, but it's so cool. I think this is like the entry. Oh, maybe not. Okay. We're way. Yeah, we need to go that way a little bit. But this way would be okay for now. If we see some more animals, we're going to have to kill them. And this episode might be a little bit longer because I want you to kind of be on the journey with me. Lots of cows around. That's good. Pigs. I'm definitely going to kill that pig. Pigs are. Okay, so we need to kind of head to the to the right a little bit. 9.50, so we're very, 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 very close. And there's the other side of the cliff. Lots of pigs. Lots of dinner. Okay, this way. It is like, like I said, it's really out of the way. But, eventually, my main goal is to gonna be able to get a, some sort of train system, transport system, going to, going to kind of the spawn area. Oh, this is cool. Some free seeds, saves me uh, trying to find them. 
Okay, minus 60. Almost there. I'd say we're pretty much knocking on the door now. Almost. Lots of dogs. Wolves. I think this is it. No. Oh, we so need to get up there. That's where we need to go. We're so close, we can taste it. We're, we're about 300 blocks away, guys. We're almost there. Loads of cool cave systems down here. And, touch wood, the, um, the server's actually been pretty good so far. I'm quite pleased with it so far. It's now behaved itself. We're generating new chunks here, I think. And we are at 30 off track, like on the Z. And if I saw some cheap, I totally forgot to get them. Okay, let's go here. Make our way up. Okay, minus 33, which is this way. Oh, we are close. We are very close. In fact, I think... Hold on a minute. I think it's this way. I think minus 33 is like where... Not exactly the entrance. I think the entrance is this way. This is what I mean. This is the mission. The mission is finding it now. I think it's... Yeah, I found it. I think this is it. Remember like this little lake thing and then yeah up there it's so tucked away it's crazy this is going to be my lab though without a doubt just has everything saying you got to do it i think one of the early stages what i need to do is, is make sure i've got some form of transport going from here to the spawn i'm pretty sure this is it Yeah, pretty sure. There's something that caught my eye, and without flying around, it you're not really gonna see it. See it. I think there's an entrance up here. Ah, yeah, there it is. Up here is like a little hole in the cliff. Okay, so this is almost the entrance because spawn is that way. Okay, so with a little bit of uh, buildy buildy this place could be a decent little place to live so let's uh, just nerd pull up a little bit yes this is it oh god okay this is not good this is really not good I need to get my strength up now because we are there. We are literally there. This is kind of like the entrance. I'd, I'd, it's nothing special. The surroundings are nothing. Nothing special. But um, just as a heads up. Um, the base with four spawners, man. It's got every one. Every, sp every spawner that you want. It's got it. So. It's going to be good. I got ideas. I got ideas. It's just go going with the flow, I guess. Okay, so we're now regenerating pretty darn slickly. Slickly? Is that actually a? Oh, oh god! No, this is going to end bad. This is going to end really bad. Where's that skeleton gone? Come on, we can do this. We don't want to die. It's the last thing we want to do. Combat's so much harder now. I'm not used to it. 
because this is like the entrance where my back is and it kind of just goes around there and all around there and it's just really tucked away it's almost like a little valley thing down here I could probably flatten it out get rid of some trees make it look a little bit more spacious where are you oh there he is Okay, this is we're we're treading on very thin ice right now. Okay, so it kind of has like this little archway here, and it kind of comes in here. And it kind of comes up here. Hang on, I got someone tailing me. It kind of comes up round here, and I'm thinking. And up there is a big ledge. I think I'm going to leave it for this episode. And what we're going to do is we're just going to tuck away in this wall. And take it from here. Because at the moment we are in a little bit of a situation. I can always I can always like patch this up at a later date. But I want to kind of set up shop here. And I'll try and show you a little bit more next episode I think. So what I'm going to do is just literally do this quick. Kind of a three by three by three room. Because there's a lot of nasties out there. This is definitely going to be maybe not where I'm going to permanently live, but this is where my lab's going to be without a doubt. My lab is pretty much the, my main focus for last season, and I need it to be my main focus. Not my main focus all season, but kind of focus on getting it up and running. So I'm just going to build a wooden door oh well that was for fail <gasps> oh crikey that was close okay I need to take this guy out where you going creeps He's wandered off. Okay, um, so I made doors. I haven't really got much food. Have I got? I've got no form of light in here. Where's that creep still gone? Where did he go? Okay, so outside the door, there's like a ledge, right? There's a ledge which has got. It's like tucked away under a cliff big ledge there's a hole in the ledge which I'm going to avoid and there's another hole uh, just like further past that gravel there and that hole leads into like an underground like big opening and it's really cool uh, to the point where it kind of sold me there and then what sealed the deal was the definitely the um, the spawners so I'm going to leave it here guys thanks for watching hope you've enjoyed this episode um, sorry it's been a longer one but um, yeah I'll see you in the next one take it easy